Hey, what's going on? This is Stephen C. Raphael, the OMAD man, here to inspire you to lose weight and eat one meal a day. Okay, even if you don't eat one meal a day, this is a good weight loss uh, inspirational channel. I'm from the planet of Omania. This is a very, very bright planet, so I got my sunglasses on. And uh, I like to fool around and play diet songs. I've got a whole bunch of new songs here to play for you. Uh, let's see. Um, I would like to start off by talking about we're going to have a guest on the show. We have Carolyn, uh, Nikki Houston. Make sure, uh, Carolyn, Nikki Houston, that you uh, uh, put in something so people could talk to and congratulate you. Tonight we have a live YouTube questions answered with the OMAD man. And I am the OMAD man. And if you don't believe it, oh, I am the OMAD man. Okay, basically we're going to go straight on to here. We are already a minute into the show. It's usually a 15-minute. Thank you for the uh, subscribing and uh, supporting the channel. And uh, I got these uh, coffee mugs, which are incredible. I like you and all the 10 reasons. Check this out. I have 90 reasons and benefits to do OMAD, eat one meal a day. Look at I had facation, facelatory, plus I had fake hair. Look at, look at my chin. And this was on like a Good Morning in America show. And that's me before and after 60 pounds. There's another picture of me. Look at, oh my God. I was always in bed. Look at my eyes. Eyes are the mirror of the soul. Look at that. Now I've got total energy. Okay, listen to this. Oh, need me in the Taco Bell. Bring me some boneless chicken. Okay, look at that. And then it looked better. Okay, you look at my daughter took a picture of me at the zoo. Look at the tummy. That is a pouch like a kangaroo, baby. Now we gotta give you some benefit. I'm not just gonna sit here and entertain you. Okay, I'd like to, um, <coughs> this Tuesday night, which is tonight, every Tuesday at seven or 7.03, so I gotta get things set up. I'm doing a YouTube Live, so please be here. Please, you guys type to each other. Sometimes there's a delay. And uh, I'd like to say hello, everybody. I'm the Open I'm here to inspire you to lose some weight. Every single day you have to make a decision. D decide, 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 decide. You got to decide if you're gonna eat that, that you go into the office, they bring donuts. Are you gonna eat those donuts? Are you gonna have that uh, coffee with all that cream and sugar? You're gonna go to Starbucks and spend $7? Seven times 30 is like $210 a month. You're gonna go and get, you know the CEO makes $8,100 an hour. They're laughing at you. Okay, if you want some coffee, go get some Folgers. Okay, uh, black coffee, um, non-caloric beverages are fine. I'd like to say thank you next year. I have a whole tour from Tennessee to uh, New Zealand, all these places I'll be doing a book signing and we'll be doing a lot of concerts and stuff like that. So uh, San Diego and we also have a cruise. Okay, I'd like to also say, if you need weight loss, uh, one meal a day, which I'm gonna get into eating one meal a day, you could watch, I have over 100 videos and where I just tell about social situations, I talk about uh, eating at the same time every day. Your stomach has a memory and it starts getting used to it. No snacking, no grazing, going to a... Uh, now, as the OMAD man, I am able to conquer any buffet. I know I have a subscriber named Tattooed Vegan Jones. How could you not go in there and pig out? Pig out, what are you, what kind of, what, what, what feelings are you trying to cover up? Okay, I just want to tell you, I'm always one click away. The old mad man's here for you each day. I'll do this. I'm gonna go into my Prince voice. I'll do a video for you. Basically, I'll do a video every single day for the rest of my life till I have a heart attack again, like I had one before. But um, my heart doctor says you can drink as much coffee as you want, which I kind of don't believe that. Um, we've got a little uh, Queen moment here. Hope you like the Queen movie. This thing called love. Actually, this thing called food. I just So much food. The 
my little Queen Freddie Mercury. Uh, uh, okay, let's see. I'd like to, my guest today for the show is Carolyn or Nikki Houston. She tries to ride on this. And uh, I'd like to show you a picture of Carolyn real quick. And she wrote, I, uh, I asked her to send me some information. There she is right there. Let's see. See, there's that picture of her. Hey, Carolyn. She was my roommate uh, when we were about 18. Did a little bit of college, but I couldn't find the parking, so I got, I left. Um, let's see. And I kept getting tickets. Okay, so I, she wrote me all these different things, and I'd like to read it. She's going to be the OMAD woman. I'm trying to beg her to, you know, so she could blog and post. Oh, my God, she's so motivated. Okay, so basically she says, I feel bad. She says, I was sick of carrying around extra weight. She had pigation. She said that uh, she was always eating like a baby. So she Googled her friend, Stephen C. Raffel, which is the old mad man. She started watching every one of the videos. December 27th, Carolyn, Nikki Houston on this. She said uh, she weighed two, uh, 156. Now she weighs 130. 10 more pounds to go. She feels better. She looks better. Um, Skinny, she feels great. Her mind is clear. She doesn't go to the bathroom as much and make the poopoation. Saves money on toilet paper. Um, she has more energy. She says, why in this country is everybody fat and in other countries are all thin? And she says, it's all about you. You could do it. And if you feel hungry, that's good. That's your body eating your fat. Do I look fat? I've kind of got a light bulb head. Okay, what else do I got here? I'd like to show you when I... Basically, uh, this is the truth. This is me having a friggin' harder to look at that. Look at that. I kind of color my hair a little bit so my fingernails get dirty. Oh, Momo Kitty! There I was 15 minutes later with about 15 people opening up. And if you think eating one meal a day, people will say, first off, don't tell any, people will say, that's drastic. Well, getting a tube stuck in your arteries or cutting your chest open and cutting your chest open and breaking your ribs, getting to your heart, that's more drastic. So eat one meal a day and you know, you're, as long as you get a little of protein, carbs and fats, that's all your, your body needs. And, and just see, so you know, I have the one plate rule. We really can't fit more than 12 or 1300 calories. And you know, if you have, you know, if you, if you're at a plateau, go down to 700 calories and get used to being hungry. Listen, after you, when you're eating going, okay, I'm going to eat slow. And after this, I'm going to be hungry. Just tell yourself you're going to be hungry. Let me tell you something. I was bipolar, but now I'm feeling better. My family didn't like me. Oh, and they did. I was so crazy, but my family didn't like me. OMAD has cured my depression. Since July 16th till today, I have had no depression. I had 40 years of depression. At 15 years old, my mother went into a psychiatric hospital. My dad had back surgery. There was always women coming into the house as a little kid. It was very confusing. I lived in a Brady Bunch neighborhood, but I, fire trucks would come over. There was always a lot of confusion. And so I was real depressed about that. We got eight minutes into this. And uh, I'd like to say that uh, I went on a date the other day and she said, Ob obesity is what she says to me. O-B-E-S-I-T-E-E, -E. obesity is what she says to me. O-B-E-S-I-T-E-E, -E. I got so fat. What do you think of that? Okay, now what I use with those a little poetic licensing, instead of going obesity with uh, I-T-Y or whatever, I, I spell it O-B-E-S-I-T-E-E, because -E -E, it rhymes. O-B-E-S-I-T-E-E. -E. Okay, I'd like to go on to my... I didn't go through the drive uh, through the drive through I saved my $7 on a drink. But you know who was working at the Starbucks? Yes! He's a big, big boy! He's a big, big boy! He's a big, 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 big boy! He's a big, big boy! You know, and, you know, people say, you know, well, I live with a big boy. You know, and uh, this big boy, you know, he doesn't, uh, he doesn't really eat that much. Well, let me tell you something. In order to be 370 pounds plus, you have to eat at least 5,000 calories a day. Let me tell you, he's going to the bathroom and eating Kentucky Fried Chicken on the toilet or something. 
I don't know where he's eating, but you cannot remain that huge by having no calories. So uh, I'd like to tell you some reality. Your appearance is in direct, is in direct with what you're thinking. If you're depressed, if, if you're sad and you cover up by eating, and your body, that's the way you look. Is, um, this is the way I'm presenting myself now. Look at, I tuck in my belt, I got jeans, I got the skinny jeans, look at this. My feet have been hurting because I went out dancing, so I got these clogs on, sorry about that. Um, so I'd like to say, uh, we're gonna go straight into our Chinese wisdom and a little bit of a poetry scripture. <laughs> Oh, my man, teach me about weight loss through a proverb of a Zen thing. Okay, grasshopper, listen up. A gem does not become polished without rubbing, nor a man perfected without trials. Because I am the old mad man. Let me tell you what that means. A fine gem cannot be cannot be beautiful unless it is totally polished. Nor a man, it's a, with, now here's the thing, what it means. I don't really remember this that much, so I'm trying to go back into my memories. Nikki Houston, which you should send her some, uh, you know, is the first three or four days, I was crying, I was so hungry. I, I had to. I watched Joe at the Revolution. I watched every single one of his videos. You know, I never thought I'd be a YouTube, uh, famous YouTube star. <laughs> Not really. I don't know. I just, I, I just do this every day, okay? And um, I just want to say that you, the first, here is your trial. You know, you're going to go through trials. You're going to be like, oh, yeah, you know, I did day three. I'm doing great. Day four. Well, today I'm on day 215. And if you want a copy of my food, every single thing I've ate, you know, maybe send me a little tip on my uh, 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 email and I'll send you back. I'll copy and paste it. It's, it's about this long. And I think I shared it on my show once. But uh, yeah, the trials. You're going to get hungry. You're going to go. You'll be four days into it, five days into it, and you go to a banquet. And it'll all be the most beautiful silver. And all you open it up, you're going to see just lust of food, lust of the flesh, so much. God. But you know what? Doesn't matter. At five o'clock, that's what I'm eating, baby. Okay, now I just want to say that uh, um, the doctor said expect a stroke soon, and I didn't even listen. You know, uh, and I just kept getting. Are you waiting for a heart attack? That's basically what what I was doing. Um, I, I would like to say that women stop wearing stretchy pants. Okay, look at this. These are look at see this right here. I got four, um, four holes. I've got in the other room, I've got this belt and it's like so long. I've got four holes drilled onto this belt. And um, I'd like to say that, uh, here's, my, here's a little bit of poetry scripture here. Consider it pure joy, my brothers, whenever you face trials of many kinds, because you know the testing of your faith develops perseverance. Perseverance must finish its work in order that you will be mature and complete and not lacking in everything. So let's go over that and that. What does that have to do with weight loss? Consider it pure joy, my brothers, whenever you face trials of many kind because you know the testing of your brain. Because the thing about it is, consider it pure joy whenever you have trials because you are gonna be trials. Think of smelting. Think of, you know, a lot of fire to, to, to burn, to, to, Every piece of metal you have or aluminum or all that stuff, you are going to get hungry. You're going to be tested. You're going to go, okay, I've got four, four days into this. I've lost three to six pounds. And then after that, you're gonna, people are going to bring over two pizzas to your house. And they're not going to care because nobody cares. Okay? And I'd like to say if you have trouble sleeping, that's how this whole thing started with me and my wife. I, I, I couldn't get to sleep because, uh, you know, I ate at 5. I was done at like 5.30. And then I started to get a little bit hungry at seven, eight, nine, ten. And so I'd have to walk around Walmart, keep myself, you know, and it was whatever. Okay. Um, I'd just like to say, please watch the uh, question and answer YouTube thing tonight. 
and uh, I'd like to tell you one message before I stop. There must be more to life than food. There must be more to life than shoving food in your mouth. What can I? I'm going to go for the three major. All you have to do is figure out what's bugging you and stop putting food in your mouth. There must be more to life than eating, than food, than eating. That was a C minor arpeggio. Thank you. Thank you for watching the Oh Mad Man. One plate a day, no snacking, no grazing. Listen, if I can do it, all of you can do it. And I was depressed as hell sitting in my bed all day. I didn't even have to work. My wife made enough money. But now I have so much energy. I got to do something. I just got to drop playing the piano over to one of those department stores where I place things like start spreading the news. I'm leaving today. Okay, thank you for watching the Oh Man Man. Watch that from tonight at 7 to 7.30 or... Seven to eight, I'll, um, I'm on live, and uh, please uh, text me, uh, Pete, leave a message of uh, three things you're grateful about. I'm grateful for this uh, YouTube channel, grateful for my subscribers, I'm grateful now that I have a life, because before I was dead, you know what? I like you! See you tomorrow, or actually see you tonight, seven o'clock.